Remote Server Administration Tools allows us to manage an Active Directory domain controller right from our Windows 10, 11, or other version of Windows Client Operating System. So from the Start button in Windows 11, I'm going to go to Settings. And inside Settings, on the left-hand side, I'm going to go to where it says Apps. Now I'll click on Optional Features over to the right. And at the top, I'm going to click on Add an Optional Feature and click on View Features. Next, I'm just going to type in RSAT, which is short for Remote Server Administration Tools. And we're going to choose the second one where it says Active Directory Domain Services and Lightweight Directory Services Tool. So I'll check that box. And you can see there's other options as well for certificate services and BitLocker and things like that. But all we need for managing Active Directory would be this one. And click Next and install. This is very similar to Windows 10, except for in Windows 10 you would go to Control Panel and then Programs and Features and click on the optional features there. So it's a slightly different looking menu, but it's the same idea. You don't need to stick a DVD in or go online to download anything. You can just go ahead and click that button. And now installation is complete. So down at my Start button, I'm going to go to All Apps, and I'm going to scroll down to where it says Server Manager, or you can just type in Server Manager either way, and I'll click on that. And this will give us the ability to connect to our Active Directory domain. So I'll go to where it says Tools, and there's all the Active Directory management tools. And I'll choose Active Directory Users and Computers. That's the most popular one. And since I'm logged in with Domain, domain Administrator Account Rights, I can go ahead and open it up. If not, it will prompt you for your username and password for an account that has those domain admin rights. And there is my Active Directory. So that is how you install and manage Active Directory from your Windows 11 computer.